Okay, so we're here at 1215 Everett Street here in Glendale. Now, we started off our running our camera from a 4-inch clean-out that's located here in the front lawn and the front yard. We'll also run the camera from an end-of-a-line clean-out that's located underneath the house. You can pretty much see all the plumbing underneath the house, but we want to check the main line over here. We obviously cannot check every pipe in the house. We're checking the main sewer line. And right now, we do have our camera in from the 4-inch clean-out. We're all the way out to the city connection in the street. So there's the city sewer right there. We're going to bring the camera back. Here's your connection to the city. The six inch clay pipe coming back from the middle of the street. Uh, it appears to be in pretty fair condition so far. I mean, it looks pretty clean, the line. What we're looking for are big breaks in the line, massive roots or massive dislocations. Um, you can see so far it looks pretty decent. There's a little bit of roots coming in through the coupling over here. Very minor roots over here. Nothing's going to cause a blockage at this time or anything. A little bit of roots coming in right over here. These can easily be cleaned out. Um, let me pause the recording. Okay, so we're now at the 4x6 connection uh, at the property line. You can see it comes back. There's some finer little cracks in the line very minor the pipe looks like it's in pretty fair condition in my opinion and those roots that you saw are not going to cause a blockage they definitely can be easily cleaned out so outside the four inch and the six inch clay pipe uh, look pretty fair condition we're going to pause the recording we're going to go around the back and we're going to run our camera through the house okay so uh we're running the camera from underneath the house and we're outside by the clean out in the front. You see here how that clean out is very poorly installed. Uh, it's sinking down over here. There's the clean out that's out in the front yard. Coming back from here, it's a clay pipe with roots in it. You see here, roots getting in. It's running underneath the concrete walkway into the flower bed. And then it's going to change to ABS here. We're going to recommend that this section of piping be replaced, fixed properly, uh, because there's no way to clean this. If you have a blockage in the house, that clean out out in the front is not going to be able to help you. You'd have to come under the house to um, release the cap and you have sewage under the house. So we're going to recommend that this section from here to the clean out be replaced. Now, coming underneath the house, we have a cast iron pipe. It's obviously getting a little old, but it appears to be still in pretty fair condition with very minor rust buildup. Doesn't look too bad at all. Whatever you do, you should never flush tampons, baby wipes, paper towels, things like that. Uh, it probably wouldn't be a bad idea once we're replacing the pipe in the front to put a two-way clean out because if there is a blockage ever in this line, uh, you can clean it from the outside and um, you'll evade the uh, possibility of sewage going under your house. But the pipe under here looks a little, doesn't look too bad. A little bit of rust buildup. Don't flush tampons, baby wipes, paper towels, things like that. Okay, so here it comes underneath the house here, you can see. So we'll go ahead and stop the recording over here.